Okay, so I am not in a wedding, but I'm going to a wedding where my other half is the groomsman or the best man. There you go, you can't say the groom. The groom is the husband, I think. Well, in any event, my other half is the best man, and my family doesn't realize that we're dating and that's who I'm dating because um, they've never actually really seen us together. Um, and we don't really take pictures together either. So this will be the first event where we get to kind of actually be in front of people. We don't do the public displays of affection. Um, so I'm actually a little nervous because I like, we don't have any pictures together. Like there's pictures of me and there's pictures of him, but there's none of us. Um, so I'm doing a review of the Crest 3D White and this is a, it's called the Glamorous White and pretty much the tube says that it removes 90% of surface stains in five days and it takes one day to just brighten your smile. Um, I'm a little self-conscious about my teeth. I have a pretty decent set as you can see. Um, thank God for my parents giving me some braces because I had gaps when I was younger. I know you probably wouldn't believe it but I did have gaps and I did wear braces when I was younger. Um, but my teeth, they're not yellow, but they're just not as white as I'd like them to be. So the wedding is on, that is September 21st. And I am really nervous. Like I said, about taking pictures and just being seen with him. Because like I said, my teeth are not the whitest. Um, and I'm, like, I'm not a perfectionist, but when it comes time for taking pictures, I like everything to be just right. It's not just right. Like, I like the picture, but I might be like, oh my God. Why did I take that picture? Um, so I'll be using Crest, and like today's the ninth, so that gives me a little bit over ten days, a little bit, a little bit less than ten, two weeks, but like about ten days for me to get my smile as white as I'm going to try and be. Now I'm going to do a two-hour whitening um, with what is it called, Rembrandt. Two-hour whitening with Rembrandt, um, maybe sometime in between to help like speed up the process. But I'm still going to continue to use it. If you don't know what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. It's the Crest 3D White um, stuff. You can get this at any store. I got mine at Walmart, which was a little bit cheaper. I think you go to Rite Aid or CVS or something like that. You go to a chain drugstore, you're going to pay about a dollar to two dollars more for it. But at Walmart, I think I paid like five eighty two maybe. I don't have my receipt, so I'm not exactly sure um, the exact price that I paid for it. But I'm going to see how this works. Because I drink coffee, I drink tea, I drink red wine, all the things that stain your teeth, and I drink soda too. So, also some other concerns that I have is um, my skin. So, you know, besides I'm trying to get my teeth to be like picture perfect, um, I also want my face to be picture perfect. Lately, I've been breaking out. I did recently just stop taking um, biotin, and I was taking between uh, one and three thousand milligrams. I think was the container. Either way, I stopped taking it. Um, one, because I'm, you know, trying to conceive, and two, you know, I did it, you know, for the hair challenge, but not really sure, uh, if that's something I want to continue, um, besides, I still haven't discussed it with my endocrinologist, so whether or not it's okay for me to take, but back to what else I'm uh, a little concerned with is my face, so I'm going to use Freeman's, it's a facial clay mask, avocado and oatmeal, and it says it help pour your Pour your pores, your pores, pour your pores. <laughs> I tell you, sometimes those are tongue twisters for me. Um, but I'm going to use that to try and clear out my face. Um, I will use the clay mask before I go to bed, or I should say when I come home from work. And I'm going to use Biore's Warming Anti Blackhead Cream Cleanser. Um, I'm going to use that in the morning when I wake up before I go to work. And the oatmeal met clay mask before I go to bed. And in between the daytime, I'm going to use some witch hazel. Just to you know, keep my face clear because I don't know if people tell me or not. But like right in here, I'm working out like this spot right there. That's a uh, has small bump and it popped on its own. Like I was washing my face and then I came out the shower and I noticed it was really red. So I must have like you know rubbed my face and like I guess popped it. I have no idea, but that's one um, mark. I'm just going to try and keep my face as clear as possible because you know I don't want to go to his wedding and take these pictures. With my boyfriend, who I've never taken pictures with before, and you know, not like you know the first set of pictures that I have of us together. Like I'm trying to create, you know, the whole memory thing. We've been together for almost three years now, and like I said, we have no actual pictures together because we don't go to family events together. Um, and that's more so because he's just like a withdrawn person. He doesn't he doesn't go to the whole family events, so I down sure don't expect him to go to my family events. Um, not to mention I barely make my family events, but like I said, it's my cousin wedding. 
And she's like, we were like best friends when we were little, so if I don't go to the wedding, she's going to be pretty pissed um, with me. Can't have that. But I also don't mind taking pictures, and I'm not, like, happy with the pictures. Because lately, I got to look at some of my pictures over the next two years, and, like, either I just look super fat or my skin look, like, really, really bad. So I don't want any bad pictures this time around. So I'm going to use the press. Uh, toothpaste to see if you can whiten my teeth and I'm going to use Freeman's clay mask to see if I can help keep my skin acne free and of course Bure the warming cleanser to you know help with that and also this warming cleanser I've used it before I do like the way it makes my skin feel I cannot use it every day though I have to use it like every other day because I have sensitive skin and too much of it will make my skin pill um, I think it's the I think it's the pronounce it silica or silicistic uh well, however you pronounce it, that acid that's meant to help clear up acne, that it does help clear up acne, but it also breaks down my skin to where it starts to feel. So every other day, I'll be using that. Um, and in between there, I do have another, um, some things are oatmeal and honey uh, facial scrub, and that's by, I think, Queen Helene or Queen Helen, however you pronounce it. Um, I, I'm going to use that on my other days, just because, like I said, I have sensitive skin. don't want it to break out. I don't want it to do damage to my skin before the wedding, because then I'm going to have to wear foundation and I really don't wear that much foundation. I need to wear a pressed powder just to absorb some oil because I put a lot of moisturizer on my face because I have sensitive and dry skin. Um, so these are all the things that I'm going to do, you know, two weeks or ten days now before the wedding. So I'll take some update pictures and I'll create like another video like that let you guys see it look like. You know, you let you guys see what me and my other half look like. Like I said, we don't have any pictures of us. It's just always me or him. It's never us together and I kind of noticed I said hey we, we can't put together any picture because we don't have any no picture book for us so I want to start making a picture book because I said I'm trying to make a baby so I'm going to have pictures before I get pregnant not be you know just hey here we are as a family and so it's like well where were you guys before the baby you know so all right enough to chat and I will talk to you guys later